Hello there everyone, so welcome to another episode of this uh, Dol Emroth campaign. We already killed the um, the faction leader of Harad and Umbar is now bordering us, which means that I'll have to control that a little bit. Yeah, I was expecting some of this to happen. Um, it should be fine, I can always reinforce with the forces here in Ramlond. Um, Right now, I have reached Fangon. Dolamroth expand, Angmar's might, new mission, send an emissary to the ends. Perfect. Yes, I was actually already going to do yes. that. Oh, hi. You have a proposition for us? This seems there, is something else there we go, I gained there. that money. Uh, I think they don't go for it because they have absolutely no money. Yeah, and they don't like that. Doesn't matter. Gave me 500 gold coins, which is cool. Settlement besieged. End of time, I gained some money. I got that uh, stuff. That is cool. Construction report. Linear. Hey, I can get the Lebanon Guardsmen. It's cool. It's cool. Uh, I should honestly get something more for money, because I'm starving with money, you know. Either homes, let's get a market there. And right now, I I really didn't want to, but I need to retrain this. There's no other way, guys. You know, we really need that, and because uh, if not, it I'm gonna have a problem. Like at, at least Gondor is actually helping out, so that is cool. So I'm gonna move this guy in. These two units, I'm gonna do the same thing. They, they're gonna move in over there. Now this army, I'm gonna land it here. And this guy, always station your guys in docks so that they, they cannot attack you. And now I'm gonna move this guy over here. These guys, I'm gonna move them to Tirithoros very soon. Oh Jesus! <laughs> I maybe may have expanded too fast. I'm gonna need a very strong army to deal with this. Yeah, they're bringing in their best troops, so I have no chance on a pitch battle against these guys. Um, the good thing is the following: if he captures Ramlond, so let let's plan that out. I have a chance if I join all my forces, of course. If I join all my forces, I have plenty of good units, good archers, you know, I have everything that I need. But, I cannot do that with these guys, like here. So, what I'm gonna leave here, it's... Uh, like this Gonda militia, I guess. I'm gonna take over there, and gather everything from here. There we go. And if he takes the city, he'll probably leave some units there. So I'm counting on that. Counting on that happening. So right now, this is where I'm gonna go. I'm gonna move here and now attack it. Two archer units. Oh, that is cool. Two archer units. Honestly, that's what, what he's sending. Did I saw it correctly? Southern Archers and Haradrim. Huh. Okay, so let's take this on as a cavalry charge. The um, best thing about the, this point is that I have defeated most of Harad's forces, um, which is in itself excellent, you know. Okay, I'm gonna have these guys in case it's necessary, but these guys I'm gonna cover them. Really don't want to lose anything from these. Yeah, I would love to have just my cavalry do this battle. Yeah, these archers are now attacking actually, that's, that's interesting. They're actually gonna stand? Oh boy. Yeah, I think the Swan Knights, you've seen how effective these guys were. 
I think they're gonna kill plenty of these southern archers. Only half the Actually, I lost remains. one. That shouldn't be. be Not that the other Haradri marchers, they're running away. And everything is now fighting against these southern archers. So they're gonna die very quickly. Yep. Captain is dead. So that is cool. Enemy general has fallen. This should be over very easily. There we go. Yeah, just a charge should do this, of course. I lost nearly nothing. I don't know where these guys came in, but I guess I was attacking only with three units. <laughs> that was silly. Still it works, of course. Good, lost two men. One of them is a general, so it replenishes automatically. So, this is the... Of course, the main um, problem is that we have Umbar attacking at the same time as, as Harad. But if I defeat this army from Umbar, he will... He's bringing in all the, the good forces. If he has this army without the general, then I can take it easily. If he doesn't, then it's a problem for me. Now, let me check his movement. He cannot reach Gobble Nirland easily. So let me move here and let me see if I can... Yeah, at least I can deploy this cavalry units over there. Free upkeep, guys. It has to count. And instead, I wanted to move over here to Tirithoros, but I guess I'm going to have to move with this, uh, with this fleet, so I cannot deploy it there. I'm going to have to move here, get all the units, and go immediately downstairs. That is the thing that we have to do. And then I'll just stay back. You know, I can develop this, start conquering Tirithoros and this uh, Haradrim town. I'm on Aethel. And then even siege this Haradrim capital before Umbar becomes a problem again. Because Umbar has a lot of units, but they also have a problem with that. Because they cannot easily take on uh, more units after that. So for now, let me check my uh, diplomats. Uh, I think I can go and talk to Dol Amroth there. Dol Amroth Dovodur, I mean. There we go, let's end up the turn. So yeah, of course Umbar is going to retake that city, but I managed to destroy, you know, forces from Harad and also the Chieftain. So that's always an, something that he doesn't have. Okay, this was not expected. The fact that you would have some units here. The enemy lays siege to our people. Let's see what I have there. To see if I can defend. Take the settlement of Tirithoros. And he would give me a, one of the yes, best units. I don't wish. know what that would be, but... Yes, as you wish. We'll see. Stop Retraining complete here. over there in Dolamath. That is perfect. He's gonna attack. New family member. Let's see the construction. So, Barat Harn built that. Could go for a library. Gobin Mirland. Hey, that Harad army did it did it move away? Hang on a second. Yeah, he is over here. That is cool. Seems like Ramland is not gonna be taken for now. I'll, I'll check that out later. I guess I can squeeze in and take Tiri Thoros. We'll see about that. What what is he sending here? Oh these are those invasion armies, basic invasion armies. I mean, I can even send these guys here to assist. I could get a general there as well. Uh, I think I'm gonna need some units, so I always have to recruit some, some troops here and there. What is this? Is this one of the best? Let me see that. Yeah, I, I think these are the best ships that he has, so I gotta be careful when attacking like this, but I'll have to. Okay, that was a clear victory. And I think I can take that again. Yep, yeah, I sunk it. 
it's good and I can move here perfect 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 so these guys if they attack my armies can defend uh, I think I think my armies can defend but I would like some reinforcement there so here's what I'm gonna do I have some generals they can go in like this general there we go he can certainly go in He cannot move away. Okay, that's that's bad, but it's also not that that bad. Uh, I'm counting that Umbar is actually not going to attack Remlon for whatever reason, so that I can move in over there and take Tiri Thoros. He also will provide me with some good units, so that's precisely what I want. There we go, this guy can take the city. Next turn, even. Uh, I know that I won't have too much money because of that. Theory Thoros will only survive three turns, so that is excellent. That will push us. Over here, I'm just gonna wait. Yeah, I merged so that I have the Amroth and Pikemen there. I'm building some Pikemen there. I think this can manage. Yeah, because the Corsair Raiders will do nothing. The general is the dangerous part, you know. And these guys can be sent on their back. And maybe they will take some of the general's forces. So I guess I guess that can be done. I'll have no cavalry there, but hopefully we'll manage. Hey, I should get one of these. Yeah, precisely. I'm going to get one of these farm and archers to defend so that I can get the coastal wardens out of there. Yeah. That is much better because it's a, a very least upkeep unit. Now we're doing we're doing what we can, guys, to siege these guys or to destroy these guys as fast as possible. If I can finish off Harad or at least conquer their capital, they will have nothing left. I think for the objectives of this campaign, I'm gonna take all the south, uh, Harad, the the Umbar tribes as well. That should be interesting. These guys, I'm going to attack them. Umbar is now attacking here, so let's see if I manage to get all the necessary troops here. Have three Gonda defenders and the guardsmen. It will have to do. It will have to do. Like, everything else here is not good. It's the Naru Naru household guard that could cause me some trouble. So, basically, I'm going to have the guards, or the units that I already have, the guardsmen, inside the city defending um, should be nice should be nice let's start deployment so these guys I'm gonna put them here or I'm gonna put them here probably like they can defend against the the ladder units there we go actually like this or or less deployed less like that it's much better I guess Let's just deploy... Oh, there, there we go. There we go, it's much better. So that it can defend easily, you know. And these guys... One of them I'm going to position here. The other two, they're going to be over here. There we go. I don't know if they should put themselves on... On shield. The wall. There we go. Should I put themselves on shield wall? I guess so. I guess shield wall is necessary here. Okay, let's start the battle and let's get these guys as soon as possible. They are right on their backs, so I can send these guys just to attack specifically their their general from the back, you know. And their archer units, of course. There we go. 
So these guys can easily survive these Corsair Raiders, I'm pretty sure of that. I mean, they have about at the same damage of this. These Gondor Defenders can certainly defend against those Raiders. And these guys, they should be able to withstand the charge there. Okay, now I can move in these guys here. Shift one, let's go. I don't want them to be running in too much. The morale is not that good. Let's fast forward. The enemy are battering down the gates. So these guys should be easy against these raiders. These walls should also not be difficult to take. I don't want them in defense or guard mode, neither of these guys. I wanted to take on these raiders. I could actually sally out and take care of these raiders, but I kind of wanted to envelop them there. If we continue like this, we will smash the enemy. Yeah, and these guys, they're fresh. They're gonna arrive just in time there, so that's okay. There we go, they're taking care of those raiders. I'm pretty sure that the, ra the guardsmen can do this. Yeah, they die very fast, so that's okay. These guys will also take care of them. So the only problem is the Naru Naru. Let me see here how it's gonna work against these raiders and archers. Okay. These guys are approaching. Okay, now I think the they can are run. No longer ours. The enemy have taken them. Yeah, I know. It's all right. I literally lost two, and he's already losing plenty of that. The enemy siege tower has reached our walls. Soldier battalion standing by. Soldier battalion. There we go. Okay, they're moving for whatever reason, I don't know why. That is cool, I guess. These guys... Oh, they'll make it so fast. These guys have yet to engage, which is kind of awkward. Oh! There we go. I'm pretty sure that I'm gonna lose all these fort archers. But I'll tell them to attack. Let's go. As many as they can kill. Thank you. These guys are doing a good jo uh, good job. I think I'm gonna pass by these Naru Naru. There we go. Pretty sure that this this guy is gonna lose like five units only, not too many, because he's so damn overpowered. Yeah, look at that. One, yay! The Ford X Men did something. Honestly, they can't do too much against these units. Uh, what I want is actually to envelop, not these guys, but these guys here. If I can attack them from behind, it's perfect. This guy has quit, so I'm going to position these guys here. These guys are now trying to attack this. It's hopeless. Yeah, I guess I could attack here. But I want this Naru Naru to fight for as long as they want. And if I can finish these guys up, if I can cause them to rout, then it's excellent. So these guys are killing them very fast. And finally I'm here. Hey, Naru Naru have lost four guys. <laughs> I've lost 60. <laughs> That's how effective those guys are. <laughs> 40 of them are better than 170 of ours. And this charge should do it. Of course, they are going to flee. There, there's no way. Even though these are only fort units, let's take away the god mode so that it can engage. There we go. Let's engage. 
And you guys, I don't know why, you're attacking these Naro Naro. Let me engage here, like this. You guys managed to kill those off? Yep. So now you're gonna kill this. And I have plenty of forces to destroy these guys. There we go. Where are you? Yeah, there's some more Naru Naru that need engaging, so let's go. Actually, let's attack these guys. Let's attack these guys, come on. Soldiers, let's move in. Let's move in. Where are you? There we go. Raiders fleeing and stuff, but uh, if my X-Men can kill some of these Naru Naru, then I'm just so excellent there. I know that my general is very tired and stuff. The more I can kill, the better. Yeah, you can see that I'm actually engaging some of this guy here. Our ally lies dead, slain by the enemy. Okay, our ally, that will be this guy. It's kind of fine. I have to be careful with the Naru Naru, because those are the guys who can kill me, honestly. Like I told you, it, it has taken me a hundred of these guys to even get just a small show of them. I'm glad that actually my older units are killing everything so easily. Because I have to completely envelop these guys and kill them. 38, that is excellent. Okay, these guys I'm going to go here. And you're going to go and engage, finally. There we go. Now we are fighting. They don't kill... Uh, as fast though <clears throat> you'll notice that their attack is very good but it's more about their defense and even then they and are they tired. flee so I guess I have this on, on the on the bat and I'll even survive with a unit of Ford X-Men that will stay here yep yeah. I can even retreat the Ford X-Men now honestly don't need that. Actually, this guy is gonna flee here. Yeah, there we go. And I can just use these guys. Because they replenish, so I don't need to use any other units. There we go. I'm gonna survive with less than, than a unit of uh, four taxmen, but it should be interesting. Maybe some casualties healed up as well, so let's go. Times six, and look at how effective these guys are. Twenty-one, twenty. Not really twenty, though. The nineteen, eighteen. Yeah, they're dead. Seventeen. Got the general, so this unit doesn't survive. This is the most important guy. As soon as they, he dies, um, he's actually done for it. Like, everything here that he's doing, it doesn't count now. Seven, six, five, yeah, they're very good, but they, army, they still die. Pursue and run them down. Good. And I won this battle. Perfect. This is a clear victory. So, I did get some... Most of my Amroth and Godsman healed up. That is excellent. Uh, not my Fort Axemen, but they did their job. They maintained the, the Naru Naru on hold. So that was perfect, actually. That was perfect. Good. It's good to know that these garrisons can withstand the attacks from... the basic attacks from the Corsairs. Victory in your name, my lord. Laying in wait for the enemy. Okay. So this guy I'm gonna go here. Let's see if I can attack or get something. I'm Rothian Pikeman there. 
Construction in Dal Amroth. About some other units. Could get some more units, but not for now. New family member, end of turn. Let me see the strongholds. What can I build? Nothing here. Uh, library here, I guess. Gobel Mirland could get a granite change, and this guy cannot get anything. Okay. Uh, instead, let me see if I can get some units. Some proper units. Coastal Wardens are, of course, interesting. Um, but I could get an Arch Militia. That's ex precisely what I'm going to get. Let's merge this guy. He's going to go over there. Yeah, he doesn't cost too much, so I guess I'm going to move here. I guess Amroth is going to move here. Good. And let's move into Gobble to Phallus. He's going to get some units. I'm going to move this guy here, actually. Oh, hi! He's actually moving in here, so that city has nearly nothing. Yeah, there we go. It's very open for, for an attack. So, here's the deal. I can attack this Umbar army. I got a spot where the other army is. I don't know. That's a problem if it is over here. Can I reach this guy here? I can. That is only... Okay, I gotta be careful about these Corsair ships. Um, if they attack me, it's a problem. It's really a problem. I gotta be careful about them. This is the fight that I'm gonna have. Gobble Mirland, what do you have here that can stay? In all honesty, it's gonna be this Archer Militia. Of course he's gonna leave. I'm very worried about that Umbar army. I don't know where it's going to be, so I'm just going to wait on this. Uh, I don't know if I can attack. I can. Uh, but I would love to station on Ramblons, just so I can defend myself. So yeah, I'm going to see this on the next episode. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye.